Hello everyone. Welcome back in today's tutorial on Informatica data quality. So in today's session we will see the overview about the Informatica data quality. So this is the developer tool for the Informatica data quality. So you can see at the left side so there is an explorer view where we can see the directories, rules and other functionality which are available inside the IDQ. So we can create the maplet and we can define the cleansing the rules, etc. So this is the developer tool which will be used for the achieving the data quality. So in today's session, we will see the introduction session on the what is informatica data quality and what are the features of it. So let's start the today's session. So what we're going to see in today's session? The first thing we will see what is the data quality management. The next thing, Informatica data quality components. We will also see the dimensions of the data quality. Then we will see what are the problems with the data quality. And then last thing, that is the data quality management processes. So let's start one by one. The first thing is what is data quality management? It is a set of processes that measures and improves the quality of business data. And that is, it is an ongoing process. So what are the examples where the data is used? So what are the business processes where the data plays a vital role? The process such as the CRM, data mining, the customer segmentation, direct marketing, call center automation, product manufacturing, and the product distribution. These are the some examples of the business processes where the data plays a very vital role. So we should assure that we should make sure that the data has a good quality before it is used in these processes. So let's see the what are the dimensions of the data quality. There are several data quality dimensions, but out of that we will more concentrate on these data quality dimensions. So it uh, the first is completeness, then comfort, comfortability, consistency, accuracy, duplicates, and the integrity. These are the major dimensions of the data quality. Along with that, the trust of the data, the decay of data, these are also the other dimensions of the data quality. But those are the minor qualities. So what is completeness? Actually, completeness determines what data is missing or what data is unusable. Comparability helps to understand what data is stored in a non-standard format. Consistency is a data quality that with which we come to know that what data values are conflicting. What is the incorrect or out of date is the accuracy feature of the data quality. Data records or the attributes refitted. If that is the case, then it signifies that there are duplicates. Integrity determines what data is missing or what data is referred. So these are the major dimensions of the data quality. Completeness, which determines the completeness of data. Compatibility, this format of the data. Consistency means whether it's how it is used everywhere in all the systems. Accuracy, whether the data is correct or not with respect to values. Duplicates, if the same data is repeated more than one time, it's called duplicates. Integrity means it's, uh, whether the data is referred somewhere or not. So if it is referred, we have to reflect it everywhere. Or that is the parameter or these are the dimensions of the data quality. And as we discussed, there are the other dimensions also like the trust of the data and the decay of data. Then what are the problems of the data? Yes. Suppose if you got 50 records from the one of the source system and it has a first name, last name, age, it's a state ID, addresses, etc. Now suppose if you want to determine whether the, all the customers have their addresses provided with the zip code or not, we can manually go and check whether the zip code is empty or null or it is provided or not by looking at the actual data. Someone might see the age, like 
is it age column populated properly with the integer numbers or not we can manually go and check that also then for the addresses whether the specific format is followed or not we can go and check and we can appropriately correct if the record is 50 or like that sometimes we also check the whether the first name is properly populated or not or the full name is properly pop populated or not or it is null so we can manually go and check now consider the a record which are coming in millions and millions so it is very difficult to check by manual so there should be some system which will help to understand what is the data quality so what are the problem whether the null values are present or how much percent of the null value is present etc or whether the data is referred from uh, one table to other table and it is really refer properly or not that we can check if it is data quality, data quantity is less what if the data quantity is more we should have some application or the tool so here is the informatica data quality tool comes into picture so what are the what are the tools then informatica providing basically there are three components available for the informatica data quality tool so first is analyst tool which will the analysts or the business people will define the data so analyst tool will be used by them to define the data to get the data then we do the profiling on the data so we have the advanced profile that is also called as explorer and the third tool is developer tool which we are going to as a idq developer we are going to use and we can achieve the data quality so basically there are three components first is analyst tool then the advanced profile and the third one is a developer tool so so these are the things associated with the data quality and how we are going to use uh, how we are going to achieve the data quality using the different components into the informatica data quality tools the next thing we are going to see is what is data quality management and what are the processes involved in it so there are four processes the first is if you see in the diagram the first pro process nothing but the profiling then the next is development then the next is collaboration and the monitoring so these are the processes which runs in the cycle it is never ending process so we define the if you see at the center of this diagram it's a data quality rules that means we define the data quality rules and on that rules the profile development collaboration and the monitors runs in a cycle out of these four major processes are subdivided into five steps the first is identifying the major the data quality yes of course we get the data so we have to get the first the data from the sources and using that we can identify and the determine what is the quality of existing data so that will be used or that can be determined using the analysis tool of the informatic mdm the second step is define the data quality rules and the goals of course we did we got the data we did analysis of the data using analysis tool then we have to define the rules so that the data quality can be improved so in order to define the data quality rules uh, in order to define the data quality rules and its goals we have to use the analysis tool once we do done with the first two step the next step comes that is the designing and the development of the data quality it is very vital and important process of the data quality management the data quality improvement process is achieved using the developer tool provided by the informatica the next step is collaborative with the business user and the implement so that means what are the data quality we have achieved using the data quality developer tool we have to involve the business people to have the the review of that or let them review the what are the output we have got after using the data quality tool so that means we are involving the business team that is it is nothing but a collaborating with the business so that can be achieved by using analyst and the developer tools that is the collaborative part the next is monitoring which can be used or the monitoring can be achieved using the monitor data quality uh, application so we have the uh, analyst tool which will be help to understand or to monitor the data 
also of course the developer will be involved during that process so these are the major process pro profile developer collaborate and the monitor along with its subsets which are mentioned in this screen so this is overview of the data quality you can watch this space or you can subscribe me for the further or upcoming data quality uh, informatica data quality tutorials thank you for watching the video if you have any questions you can mention in the video below thank you for watching the video